This week I was manufacturing these little holders for our old beds. It's for the beds from uh, our flat owners. We got a new good bed for ourselves, uh, but we cannot throw away the bed from the owners. So we decided to keep it in a storage room. We will put them vertically on the wall. As this is a very temporary thing, I didn't want to invest a lot of materials or a lot of time uh, in that. So I used only scrap wood from my old projects. These pieces are from the palette project. I had to cut the palette a bit to, to fit the size of the workbench and this is what has left. This is the piece of wood from the TV table project. I just took a little piece from, from that. I attached it to, to these pieces of scrap wood. This plank I just found on the street. I think it's a plank from some palette. It was twice longer, so I cut it in half for having two holders. I will attach it to the plank. You can see the result. A bit messy, but it will do its job. I will attach it to the wall like that. Hopefully it will hold the beds vertically in our storage room and the job will be done. The only investments I did were some screws, glue and paint and some time of course. At the beginning I didn't want to make them in this way with these names. I just wanted to, to make them very simple and just to paint a bit to protect from environment and that's all. But later I thought, ah, okay. I can show how you could reuse scrap wood for some simple projects like this. It's the matter of your imagination. You decorate it a bit and look, the, the result is pretty interesting. I'm very happy about that. It's a shame that nobody will see it because it will be hidden behind the beds. But when you remove them, you have this and maybe later in the future you can, you can make some shelves if you put some plank above it. Very simple but very nice result. I also had a chance to test one of the tools from my new Parkside tool collection. And I'm really surprised about the quality of this tool because it was quite cheap and quality to price ratio is amazing if you're just a hobbyist like me it's an amazing tool to have uh, especially for this price i'm really surprised about this brand so far i was expecting something worse but they continue surprising me in a nice way so this week this project was a bit urgent because we are storing the beds now in the living room and they are taking space and they're not nice to be there. So I had to focus on this to craft these little holders. I hope it can inspire you for creating something of your own to reuse some scrap wood that maybe you thought to throw away. But me personally, I like how sometimes you can, you can use your imagination and to craft something interesting, something unexpected even for yourself. And this is awesome, this is amazing. Also, this week I found uh, several palettes on the street, which I will be disassembling uh, next week. And I will show you how you can reuse that wood from palettes in other projects. Uh, I will show you how I use it. Now I will also have to remove these planks that I were storing here in the storage room. I plan to use them in uh, Paradise in my workshop uh, to make some shelves. Uh, that I found them on the street near our house. I'm storing them here for, for a long time now and I think they lost their shape. They, they deformed a bit as you can see. But I hope I can straighten them uh, with the help of some holders. So right after installing the beds I will pack this 
to my fair and we will go to the paradise. I also brought this microwave to the paradise. It's it's not working, I have to fix it. Mm, I have to change some fuse and I will have something for warming up my meals here in the workshop. But it's another story. I also found another palette uh, when I was going here. Uh, another one for my collection of palettes that I'm going to dis disassemble next week. Uh, I have several projects in mind for that, for reusing the wood from these palettes. And these two planks that are over two meters, uh, I plan to put them over that blue workbench on the top. Uh, I don't know how they will fit there yet, but we will see next week as well. Uh, should be a nice shelf. Mm, taking it on into account that it's for free, it's from the street. People are throwing away different kind of stuff here in Spain. And I'm happy to collect it and to reuse it. Especially that I need some shelves, some more flat surfaces to store things. So yeah, happy about that. That's how my week was here in the workshop. I'm very happy for the progress looking forward to see what the next week will bring I have a lot of plans hopefully I will show you something interesting next week I hope you had a nice last week enjoy this week see you next week bye